What? How excited are you about it? Good. Good? No, mm. like how excited are you? A lot. Like really excited? Mm. You have been wanting to open this thing. Where'd we get it at? Tell them all about it, bub. Tell them what it is. Tell them all about it. It's a BB gun rifle, uh, Red Rider. Yeah? Where'd you get it from? Walmart. Look, it's the Christmas edition. It says, a Christmas wish. Maximum velocity, 350 feet per second, and it shoots the .177 caliber BBs. Is that the size that we have? Yeah. Yeah, we already have them, huh? Mm -hmm. Is that your first Red Rider? Yeah. That's your first BB gun rifle? It's my first time shooting it. You earned it, buddy. You've been a good boy. You've been doing chores and being a big boy at school mm -hmm. and minding and eating all your food, haven't you? Yes. That's, that's my big boy. You want to open it up? Open it up. Uh-oh. Looky there. Here. Pull it out. Pull it out. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Look at that. Tell me that ain't cool. That's what you're wondering. What? Here, no, no, no. Don't do that. Oh, yeah. Hold on. What? Wow, it's a little heavier than I thought. Look at that. Look down the sights. Hold it up to your shoulder. Look, to, look with this eye. This one. Other eye, buddy. Use this eye. Other eye. Bubba, look. I'm using the right eye. Look, you need to use this eye. And close this eye? Kind of. Try it. Other eye. I think you're left eye dominant, buddy. Looks like you want to use it. Can you look down that and see that all right? Line up good? I can line it up good. All right. That's a beaut, huh? Yeah, that's a beauty. <laughs> okay, here's your safety button right there. So that's fire, that's safety. See the okay. trigger won't pull? Mm -hmm. See when it's on fire, this will pull back. So okay. safety. Go ahead and try to cock it. Oh, what's that? Oh, look, it even has a built-in compass. That is cool. <laughs> Here you go, try to cock it, Bubba. You're going to hold it right there and use that hand and cock it. Oh. All the way up. Nope. Uh-huh. Keep going. Oh, is that all the way? Keep going. There it is. Now all the way down. Okay, is it on safety? Mm-hmm. Okay. It's on safety. See? Now, before we load it, no, nope, that is safety, okay? Sure. Hold it up to your shoulder. Nope, like you're gonna shoot it. There you go. Click it off safety and see how she fires. Go ahead and fire it. There's not a BB in it. You're all right. Click it off safety. Go ahead and put I'm it up there scared. and fire it. It's it's not going to be like a 410. It's easy. It's hold hold it tight. Rough. No, just hold it tight. Go. See, that ain't bad, is it? <laughs> yeah. That's perfect. That's perfect. All right, let's go load her up, dude. Yo! What up, y'all? And welcome back to another one. Uh... It's a very special video. Y'all know. I don't have to explain it. If you're a child and don't know what a Red Rider is, you need to go uh, watch some Christmas movies. Did you get them? Mm -hmm. There you go. Uh-huh. I don't know how to load it. I think, isn't that what it's called? I know. It's a little past my time, not much, uh, but I think it's a Christmas wish where he, uh, he gets the Red Rider. Y'all have to drop that comment down below because y'all know. I think it's called A Christmas Wish, and we need to watch it. You haven't seen it yet, bub. But, but there's a little boy that gets a Red Rider for Christmas, and his mom goes, You're going to shoot your eye out with that thing. And it is a very iconic movie about the Red Rider BB gun and Christmas and a little boy. So he has, uh, I'll show you the BB gun we've been practicing with. Y'all went to North Dakota with us, and you've seen Bodie try to shoot the 410. It was just a little much for you, wasn't it? It was a little too big for me. Yeah, it was just too big, and it kicked really hard, huh? Yeah. This is what we need, huh? Yeah, it's, it's, it's not that strong pushing back on my shoulder, but it does push back on my shoulder a little bit. No, it won't be bad. You want to load her up? Sure. You can tell people where you got her and everything. We got this Red Rider BB gun rifle from Walmart. Yeah, we did. How much was it? 30. 30 bucks. 30 bucks. We were headed back to get some worms, weren't we? We went fishing this morning. No luck. It's too windy out. But um, Way, way too windy. Way too windy. And um, we passed an end cap with these on them. And I was like, 
was $29. And I'm like, he needs it. He really does. So he's earned it. He's been a good boy. I'm proud of you. We got to keep up that good work One in school. I ate all my dinner too. Yeah, you've been eating all your dinner like a big boy, huh? Mm -hmm. That's my man. I love you. Let's go, uh, let's load her up. Ooh, there you go. All right, looks like you push down. Oh, there we go. Opens up like that. Go ahead and fill that up, buddy. Don't spill them. Nice and easy. There we go. Okay, well, whoa, 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 whoa. Let me see it real quick. Oh, it'll fit a lot. Look at that. Well. One more. Okay. Let's see. So, uh, we had a lot of guys commenting, and I appreciate it. Uh, when we went to North Dakota about how Bodie was struggling with the uh, bolt action 410. And I'll tell you, just too much. Too much oomph. That was the main problem. So, a lot of you commented this. A lot of you. So, when I seen it, I'm like, you know what? That's a perfect option. This is what, here we go. Is it Make, cocked? No, it's not cocked. Just watch where you're pointing it, please. This is what we have been uh, playing with. Little BB gun. This is my first BB gun I ever owned. Um, and it is it is what it is. It's a pistol. Do what? This is my first BB gun I ever owned. Well, that one is, but that's your first BB gun rifle, huh? Yeah. That's right. You ready to shoot her? Mm -hmm. All right. Good aimer. That's a good aimer? Yeah, that's a good aimer. Make sure she's always on safety. We're gonna flip her down, cock her up, cock her back. She's still on safety. Go ahead and gear him up, flick her off safety. Just do it with your trigger finger. There you go. Aim it at the back. Oh, there you go. See if you can cock it. Now put on safety. Cock it, put your foot on it. There you go. There you go. Cock it. All the way up. You gotta go all the way to here. Keep going. Let's see if that's all the way. Yep, that's all the way. Now push it down. There we go. Now it's still on safety. Click it off with your... up here. Click it off up there. Look where your finger is. There you go. Watch. Aim it down the sights. Shoot the middle of it. Ooh, nice shot. You ready to shoot some cans? Yeah. All the way up. There it is. Now down. All righty. Go ahead, buddy. Shoot that can. Try it. Right at the can. Ooh, I don't think you hit it. Recocker, put on safety. See if she's aiming high or what. Okay. See it one more time. Ooh, it's right on, bub. I mean, it is. It's aiming good. Aim her up there. You gotta look down this. Look, look. Get it up there. You gotta put that notch in here. Put it on the can. Ooh, you were right beside it. You was one inch off. That's where I hit it. It's actually going through the can. Look at that. You can get it, Bubba. It's just still a little long for you, isn't it? Yeah. All right. Let's see. We're going to fix this bad boy up so it will fit you good. Okay. Look what we got. Oh, yeah. We're going to fix you right up. Hold it up there like you're going to shoot it. So bring it back. Okay, let me see it. All right. Do I got to like rest my chin on that? Just gonna cut some of this butt stock off for you. Oh boy, all righty, here we go. At least it was only 30 bucks, right? Yeah. Oh. That wasn't too bad. Alrighty, now, come on this side. Over here. 
Can you think that'll fit in? Uh, yep, try it. Try to shoulder it now. Put it in your shoulder. Ooh. Up here, can you hit the trigger? Is that better? Oh, yeah. Perfect. Totally better. <laughs> oh, that's all it took. So. Just one little minute. That's all we took off, and it fits him beautifully. Now, shoulder it up there again. Aim it. Look down them sights. No, put it up in your shoulder. Better. Let's go try it. There you go. How's that feel? Good. A lot better. Oh! <laughs> you hit it! First try! That's all it took! Do it again! Can you cock it by yourself? It's a little tough still. Yeah, I need help. Put it on, uh, you need help. Put on safety. You got it. Woo! <laughs> You got it now, don't you? Yeah, now my you, second try. Now you see how you line these up, right? Yeah. How you line those sights up. Right. You gotta line them all up. That's my boy. Like that. Awesome. <laughs> Are you struggling trying to cock it still? Yeah. We gotta get used to that. Hey, back up a little bit. Back up, way back. Way back, you can't be that close. It can ricochet, buddy. All right, now shoot it. See, when you're, when you're cocking it upside down, you can't cock it upside down because if you can't cock it like that, you're not getting a BB. You gotta cock it right side up or it's not loading a BB. That's the thing about it. You gotta cock, not upside down. You gotta cock it like that, bub. Or it's not gonna load a BB. Yep, just like that. Try that. I can't there you go. Like do it. There you go. There. Now, you probably have a BB in there. See if it works now. All right. Woo! See, you gotta cock it right there. You hit that can. You got her down now, son. I, I, that's all there is to it. Just like that. You gotta cock it right side up. There we go. Woo! About knocked you right off the wooden post. That boy right there, he's on fire. I'm proud of him. <laughs> Oh, look, you got it down now. <laughs> He's just going to keep going at it. Everybody out there, fathers, sons, grandfathers, um, please drop a comment down below. Number one, if you had a Red Rider or if you had, maybe you had both, um, the Marksman Repeater. How many had this? A lot. A lot of people had the old Markson, Marksman Repeater and or the Red Rider. Um, drop a comment down below if you have a really awesome story about you receiving your Red Rider, Red Rider or Marksman Repeater, drop that story down there so we can all read it. Um, very special times, me and Bodie. Uh, if you didn't know, Bodie's five years old and uh, on the North Dakota trip with the Honkers, I was really wanting him to smack one with the 410. Uh, so I put a hot load in there, which was a uh, three inch tungsten load. It's the uh, federal TSS turkey loads. And um, just a, honestly, a little bit too much boom. Y'all seen it. He was, scared, he was scared of it right away. This is the way to go for about the next year or two, maybe three, until, he, uh, until he's ready for the 410. Now, we, we can start shooting the old, four, or the old 22. That, that's next. So... You know, the old 22s, they don't kick that bad, so. Now, let's come back here a little farther, dude. You ain't gotta be that close. Come back here. There you go. Try it, try it right there. But uh, what is your uh, special story as a child? Or um, maybe you're the dad. Maybe your story is you the dad buying it for your child and how you surprised him. What's your story? Drop a comment down below for me and Bodie to read and let us know. You on safety? Go ahead and cock it again. Put it in between your legs like you were earlier. There you go. See, that's a lot easier. How many of you remember being just a little guy? <laughs> Barely able to cock a BB gun. Ooh, good shot. He smacked it. Barely able to cock a BB gun. And Bodie doesn't have the strength to even cock the old marksman. So... 
still a little guy, you know. I have the strength to cut this. You have the strength to do it. We know. You're a big boy, bub. All right. Just for poops and gigs. <laughs> Uh, before we go on the lodge here, I figured we'd just do something a little exciting. That's not exciting. That's very exciting. We got the old Stoger out here, haven't used it much. I'm gonna pop that can with a three and a half inch double BB uh, Federal Black Cloud load. <laughs> just, just cause we can. Oh, goodness. Oh. What's that? It's wood. Oh. What's that? Oh, well, there's a block of wood. Whoa. That just shows you how powerful that three and a half inch is. Look at that. Oh, my. Yeah. Go That's find, too cold. Where's the can at? Go find the can. I don't know where that can is. Oh, there it is. It's up there. I aimed a little low at that can. Go grab him. What's it look like? Bring it over here, show us. Oh, I complete, almost completely missed the can. I just hit the block of wood. Fly over. Yeah. Look at the sky, it's gonna get nasty. I'm excited, let me see that shell. You got that shell? <laughs> Bodie, he's got the three and a half. That does smell good, don't it? Mm -hmm. That smells good. Not a better smell, huh? All right, go on. It smells as good as it can smell every day. Oh yeah, bike powder. Who put up? Who, who put this there? You. We've been we've been putting new mounts up in the lodge. Are uh are you ready for clients to come in? Yeah. Ready for Bert to get here? And you, cook the boil. And cook the you miss having boils? You want you miss you miss old Bert's cooking? I mean, mm -hmm. we all miss Bert's cooking, don't we? Ready for all the boys to be here and all the clients? Isn't it crazy? I can't believe it's only a couple weeks away. Literally a couple weeks. That's it, bub. You ready for everybody, man? Yeah. It's a lot of fun. We do indeed have a bunch of fun. Um, we have boils. We set big old tables out here and uh, put plastic over the top and dish out boils. And um, I'm really excited. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I uh, went and looked at birds today, a little migration update. We've had some more specks come in. Um, there's only a couple bodies of water that I can kind of go to and get a good judge uh, of what's moved in, all right? Uh, there's not a lot of like refuges to go to and, and, and get a good, uh, you know, bird's eye view on, on the population. There's only a few spots, so with a uh, lot... <laughs> With a lot of our refuges being dry, that's that's the number one problem. Um, it's going to be a lot of big water birds roosting this year, and I already see it. And that's what we usually have over here: sand pits, lakes, uh, residential. A lot of residential birds. It's gonna. It's probably going to become more abundant this year with residential roosting geese, if you know what I mean. So, good for us because that's our number one option we got already. So. Uh, but like I said, we're hanging more mounts here. If y'all are interested in coming to Sand Hill, uh, I'm going to be very honest, we are pretty full. There are very, very, very like one to two select little dates and, and there could be some people back out, you know, so that could always be um, a possibility. But if you're interested, fill out the booking form at sandhillflyways.com and come hang out with us. Um, like I said, we're pretty full this season, but even if you want to... Uh, be the first on the list. What's that? My bullet, see? From the client. Oh, that's cool. Oh, they gave you that, huh? Mm hmm Yep, they signed it and gave it to you. Bears, New York. Gov Duck, I think. Hmm, I remember that. Um, some New York clients came and gave him that. Uh, I completely lost my train of thought, but I, that's a cool shell. Mm -hmm. Go put it back on the shelf so you don't lose it. What all we got over there? We should show them. We got all kinds of old shells. Check these out. Daddy, I want this little tank. Mm hmm hold on. These are really old, like old brown color, three and a half inch federal, three and a half inch magnum 
T steel shot. I have never shot T's. But like I was saying, if uh, you even want to uh, get on kind of the first of the list uh, for next year, the 23-24 season, you can still fill out the inquire to book form and state, hey, I want to book for the 23-24 season. And then uh, when it comes around, and I, and I can even give you a call right now, and I can put you on the list and, and uh, the number of guns you're thinking. And so you'll be at the top of that list when the books open next spring. And like I've said already, it's going to be a lot, a lot, a lot more affordable uh, for everyone. Next year, we're probably going to have to get rid of cooking meals, but we'll provide all the food necessary for you to cook your own. Um, and just knock down that price right off the top so uh, more of you can come and, and enjoy it here. And uh, I'm going to have to lighten my load a little bit, you know, providing food and, and everything. But like I said, the freezers, fridges will be stocked for you all. Stove tops, grills, everything. And all you got to do... Pick out what you want that night, thaw it, grill it, cook it, do whatever. Uh, we're right up against town, so you can order pizza, you can go out to eat, you can do whatever you want. What are you trying to get into? What is that? Hot chocolate, I want it. <laughs> Hot chocolate? Yeah, it's uh, cold. I know what you I See, I'm ready for the cold too, Bubba. I get it. I get it. It's Just cold sit. outside. It's not even nearly cold outside. It is over 80 degrees right now. Bub, it is not cold. I still want hot chocolate. <laughs> but thank y'all for being here. Uh, old Bodie, you ready to get out on some duck huntings? Mm -hmm. I think it's gonna get good this coming week. Uh, we're gonna, uh, the temperatures are getting ready to drop overnight. The highs are gonna be back in the 60s, lows in the 30s. Uh, so we'll be looking really good on birds. Be expecting some awesome hunts to come. Uh, hunting season's here. Hope you all are getting out there and being extra safe and enjoying your time with your loved ones, your best friends, making memories, because that is what it's all about. Just want to always say, it's, all, it's not all about getting the limit or shooting the most birds or bragging, bragging. Get out there and make, have some fun. Make some memories with the people you, you love doing it with, right? The people you want to make those memories with. Like this dude here. Love you, buddy. Bye. Let's go.